Today we're doing no stir fry chow mein. So this is chow mein made in the oven. So let's check this out. Uh, this is a very popular way to make chow mein, especially when you're having a big party or when you don't want to stir fry. So these are the fresh chow mein noodles made out of whole wheat and eggs. So, so we have a pot of boiling water going. After boiling the noodles for about one minute, you're ready to transfer the noodles into cold water. So just run the noodles under cold water. In a pan, just put about uh, three tablespoons of oil. Then you're just gonna transfer the uh, noodles directly onto the pan. So just transfer the noodles directly onto the pan. So just spread the noodles out on the pan here. And then add a teaspoon of salt over the noodles. Okay, so add a teaspoon of brown sugar. Then you add a teaspoon of sesame oil. Add a teaspoon of dark soy sauce. You can use the light soy sauce too if you like. Just use a pair of chopsticks and uh, toss the noodles a bit. Oh. Yeah. So just so just put the uh, tray of chow mein into the oven and bake at 320 degrees for about 30 minutes. Sando. So just give the noodles a good shake, turn the noodles over so they don't burn on one side. So we're going to stir fry the uh, ingredients, the toppings. So you can use whatever you like. We have some uh, Chinese sauces, uh, sliced chicken, Chinese veggies. We've got some colorful red peppers, orange peppers. We've got uh, celery and onions. So you preheat a pan or a wok at medium heat. You put about uh, two tablespoons of cooking oil. So we've got uh, coconut oil here. You can use uh, any kind of vegetable oil, like canola oil, corn oil, or uh, other oil, but uh, don't use olive oil. Olive oil burns real easy. So I'm gonna put about a tablespoon of uh, ginger and garlic. Just stir fry that for a second. So I'm gonna put the uh, veggies in first. So you have the onions and the celery, the red pepper, the orange peppers. Huh? So also add some uh, veggies. You can use whatever kind of Chinese uh, greens that you like. Okay. Okay. So next we're going to just add some uh, chicken. You can add a little more uh, cooking oil if you like. So I'll put another tablespoon of oil here. So the chicken will be the chicken will be about halfway cooked, and then you add the uh, Chinese sausages to the chicken. So that, give that a good stir fry. Add about a teaspoon of salt. Add a half a teaspoon of sesame oil. Maybe a teaspoon of uh, light soy sauce. So add about a tablespoon of oyster flavor sauce. So just turn the heat on to high for about 30 seconds to a minute. Get a good sear there. So stir fry the veggies and the meat. So we're gonna make a little sauce with that as well. So we put about a cup of water with about uh, three tablespoons of cornstarch. So this will make the sauce. Add more cornstarch solution if you need it. Sometimes it gets sometimes it gets too thick. So just to make the sauce a little darker, just add a dash of uh, dark soy sauce. So maybe like a, a teaspoon or something. So just give the uh, ingredients a final stir fry there. 
Right, and you'll, you'll add some uh, green onions just before serving. I just need. Uh, take the uh, noodles out of the oven. So it's been about half an hour. Put the toppings on top of the noodles. Chow mein with chicken, Chinese sausage, and vegetables. Enjoy. So this is an easy way to make chow mein for parties. We have a lot of people coming, and you don't want to stir fry. Hello. Hi. Yeah, we always eat it this way. It's a really nice way to make them chow mein. Thank you.